So, what should we do? Without provisions, surely our only choice is to turn back. Hmm. Not that I have any money, but we'll figure something out. Sounds like we don't have a choice. Fine then, let's get moving. All right, shall we get back to the car? Leave the driving to me. Oh, a new treasure. Ah, shucks, it's just a toy duck. It's got bite marks too. They must have been so hungry. They'd even eat a toy. That's no laughing matter. There's no military food relief here, and bandits are rampant. It's no wonder the people would starve. Rumor has it that starvation drove them to eat horrible things. Horrible? Like what? Prince, some things are better left unsaid. Why? Because we're talking about humans doing something. Something that is taboo, even to us demons. Pull down there. It's plenty taboo to us, too. And yet... They must have been in dire straits to come so close to breaking that taboo. Ah, so you're saying this toy, like, symbolizes a taboo? That's kind of cool. I'll keep it. That's not the issue here. Huh? Where are all the people? Looks like it's abandoned. Oh, uh, why did they all leave? They likely moved somewhere safer. It's dangerous around here. here. It's looking pretty beat up. It could have been anything. Maybe they were attacked by bandits or got hit by a natural disaster. turn out to be useful later. I can't believe humans actually managed to live here until recently. You know what they say, there's no place like home. There we go. Which means they must have had an even more powerful reason to leave. Let's head for that stone arch. Talbo's just beyond it. Yeah, it's about time. really better in the old days? Good question. The world's taken a turn for the worse, sure. But humans had plenty of problems back then, too. Perhaps so. 
But we were never half as cruel as you demons. Hey, we might play tricks on people, but we don't kill. <laughs> you must be joking. The legends say that as long as anyone can remember, demons have... Ha! <laughs> Humanity has always loved to blame us for anything and everything under the sun. When the river dried up, I bet you all said it must be the demon's fault, didn't you? If what you say is true, perhaps we have misunderstood you. Now hold on. Don't get the wrong idea. We totally are bad. Why, just yesterday, I stayed up late and went to bed without brushing my teeth. See? Bad to the bone. That's what being a fiend is all about. How about you, old man? Bet you've committed a minor sin or two. Come on, spit it out! I have killed men. Many men, indeed. What? It was in war, yes. But killing is killing. War, huh? That's some serious stuff. Look at that rock. It's got weird scribbles on it. Ah, that's a bandit symbol. They use them to mark off their territory. There's bound to be some of them skulking around this area. I like the sound of that. How about a little preemptive bandit butt kicking? No, do not approach them under any circumstances. Understood? <laughs> Fine. What about running through with a boost? That might break it. Uh, something would break, all right. A car. Huh? Fresh meat inbound! Huh? First one in ten days. What? what the heck just... All four tires punctured. Have at them, boys. Go rob them blind. And if they resist, feel free to off them. I take it you punks are responsible? Check it out, thief. Get a load of their their clothes look an awful lot like yours, Prince. Uh, a brat with a big mouth! Allow me to teach you some manners! Take that! Don't want to be here in the war! Fine. useless can you people be? Take that! Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Ow. <laughs> you got me! I must say, you're quite strong for a pipsqueak! Just wait. Till you see what I'm packing. Nobody's allowed to be more evil than a fiend. Still kicking, old timer? Yeah, thanks to you. Never would have believed just how strong fiends are if I hadn't seen it for myself. Oh, please, those guys, they were nothing. There's an even more pressing matter. The car, can it even run? No, not in this shape. We've no choice but to walk it to Talbo. It's not far. Ah, are you 
serious? Oh, for the... I can't believe this. We're not far now. Look, over there. You can see it. He's right. Come on, thief. All right, all right. What's it like in Talbo? It's a former mining town. Not as well off as it once was, but still the biggest town around these parts. Yeah. Mm hmm. That's where they have the Aquanium mine, isn't it? Or what's left of it. By now, the Aquanium veins tapped out, and the mine's been shuttered. Of course you used it all up. You humans never know when to stop, do you? Oh. Well, I'll keep it. It might turn out to be useful later. turn out to be useful later. Oh, hey old man, is that the town? Yes, that's Talbo. Now, you two should wait here. It'll cause havoc if people see demons wandering around town. I'll go on my own. Wait, we need water and food, right? Thief can just steal them for free. Huh? N no, that's all right. As a sheriff, I can't condone. I thought you didn't have any money. Don't be ridiculous. Thief's a pro at stealing. You have the costume, right? Yes, of course, Prince. I never leave home without it. Oh, this is murder on my hairstyle. What's that supposed to be? Even if I get caught, I can just talk my way out as long as I'm wearing this. See ya! Is that a... It is! A motorcycle! Looks like it's in good condition. Think I'll use this to make my escape. All right then. Now to get what I came here for in the first place. Ah, just what I was looking for. These will do nicely for provisions. Looks like there's still plenty more for the taking. Okay, I'll grab what I need and head back. <sighs> oh, 
Well, that should just about do it for this month's taxes. Everything I work for gets taken by the Royal Army. Bastards. Oh, sounds like these supplies are earmarked for the Royal Army. Stealing from the Royal Army doesn't trouble me one bit. Take everything you can get, I say. this rate, I'll be done in no time. Well, I'll be. Bororo Cattle. You scared my boots off. Looks like good eating. Uh, too big to bring back, though. All right, you're off the meat hook. I've got places to be. Comfort. Ah, oh, that coat's softer than a lullaby. Ah. Uh ah, -huh. uh, Spino. You have to go south. It's hard to spot, surrounded by mountains. But uh, what do you want with that desolate old place? Girl, one looks all you need to know she's not from around here. Whoops, <laughs> never mind that. I'm here for food, not gossip. Tank parts. Way too heavy for you. Leave it to me. Tank parts? Hold up! You mean there's tanks at nap space? I mean, they're getting parts for them, aren't they? Man, a tank! Just once I'd like the chance to modify one of those babies! <laughs> Quit dreaming. With your skills, you just end up busting it. Oh, treat me like a low-level grease monkey, will ya? Oh, -ho! a tank, you say? <laughs> I've got to tell the prince. Some strange girl just asked me for directions to Spino. Spino? You know, where the rebel army had its base way back when. I hear it's been deserted ever since the royals stormed it decades ago. Huh, what brings her there? Don't know. Strikes me as odd, though. Huh. You think she could be up to no good or something? Hmm. 
Don't know what harm she could do there if she tried. Nothing of interest to us here. 